Dislike Dave? No, nah, it's just as a nickname. Know, my it's my birth name, so I kind of try to go by that, but it's whatever. I kind of go by anything. Okay, because I don't know if you know this, but Magic Johnson. I'd heard that Magic, the nickname, came from a sports reporter, <laughs> and uh, a, a sports one of the other sports reporters in my office. After your big game last week, or during the big game, we were watching it online. He uh -huh. texts me and says. David Marr is a monster, <laughs> and I think that's your new nickname for him. He's calling you monster. That's Pro funny. appropriate, I guess, for uh, October. Well, I mean, maybe for that one game. We'll see how the rest of the season goes. You know? <laughs> how do you like? Mo yeah, Monster Marr is a nickname. For <laughs> Sounds good, but uh, I don't know if it fits. You know, I got a little stature, but you know, <laughs> big heart. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you. Do you have any other nicknames other than uh, Dave? D Marr. That that's usually people call me. I got a couple from my friends. They call me Poodle. Uh, Mark Wait, Sack. Poodle? Yeah. Where does that yeah. one come from? Uh, just, I don't know. People like to give me a hard time, but it's, uh, you know, I kind of just go with it. It's whatever. You mentioned the size thing. Did you, <laughs> do you feel like, you know, people maybe can underestimate you at times, including, you know, the Cal Poly fan base? Uh, definitely. You know, I kind of my whole life I've been undersized, and I kind of like flying under the radar, you know, keep the eyes off me and just kind of like to surprise people. Is that what can kind of help you? Because I know, you know, you look at the roster and you see, you know, Mark Rogers, West Virginia, and, and DJ UCLA, and then, you know, here you are, homegrown talent, <laughs> and you're able to, you know, have a big game. Do you think that helps you guys, you know, defense is concentrating on other guys? Uh, I mean, a little bit. I think, you know, we got a lot of weapons on this offense, you know, from all the skilled players, and, you know, we got two pretty much all-American fullbacks. You know, it's, it's hard to defend us when everything's going right. You know, it's... Um, I, I really enjoy playing with the guys on the on this offense. You know, when we distribute the ball and get the ball spread around, I mean, you saw what can happen. I mean, 50 points. You know, there's not too many times people you know score 50 points. You guys used to do it all the time back in 2008. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. so people are used to seeing that kind of stuff around here, I guess. But um, what what did you do in high school? Were you mostly a runner or a nah, receiver? Or I played what? quarterback in high school. Um, I mean, I tried to throw the ball as much as I could, you know, I like to throw the ball, but uh, got to Cal Poly and didn't take a snap at quarterback and kind of moved from slot to receiver, they tried me out at DB a little bit and then back to receiver and then finally last year uh, moved me back to slot and kind of found a home. Yeah, so none of those are your your position from no, no, school days. No. Nice, well, you're doing pretty well with it. Yeah. Uh, some people have told me that your brother is even better than you are. Uh, he he has the potential to be a lot better than me. Yeah, he's better than I was when I was his age. So. How so? Uh, he's bigger, a lot bigger than I am. Well, I mean, not height wise. I mean, he's stronger, stockier. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he's faster. And he's played running back his whole life. I mean, he's a very very smart runner, and um, he's been doing it for a lot a lot of years. Yeah. So watch out for yeah. Austin Mar. Yeah. Up and coming. Yeah, he's a monster. <laughs> yeah.